Hello and welcome everyone to this opening video. From my personal experience, I know that in other games, people really love watching opening videos like, you know, Counter-Strike and, and uh, Robocraft, uh, some mobile games. All of these games you have chests, crates and uh, some boosters. Anything that you just open and yeah, it's RNG, people don't like RNG, many people hate RNG, but still, people get excited about opening, crawling stuff, because uh, you need lots of luck, and if you get something really cool, you get excited, and the viewers also get excited, they share the same feelings, hopefully. So, maybe the openings in Double Action are not so exciting, not so great. You know, we've got this addition of these new chests. We had some chests in the past, now we have in sort of more different types of chests. We have uh, the silver chests, the mission chests, the gold chests, dead man's chests. Uh, we have also epic chests, pain chests. Yeah, the number of these chests kind of is big, I would say. We didn't have so many chests in the past. But overall, I've gathered lots of these chests. Uh, there are only two types of the chests, sadly. I was trying to get more types to make it more diverse video, but anyway, I hope you will still like it. We have mission chests and we have uh, silver chests. So I've been doing lots of uh, admiralty missions to get them as rewards. And I've been also doing uh, the epic events to get them as well. And we are here right now with the 19 chests total. And right now, somewhere in the middle of your screen, there should appear the loot tables from all of the chests so you can actually figure out what sort of stuff you can get from every each type of these chests many people think that silver chests are much worse than the gold chests that's a not really true i wouldn't I agree with that because a good silver chest can give much better sum than the terrible gold chest so yeah these things are like not really so clear for many players the openings in novel action are not so interesting because well overall if you would ask me, we don't have any animations, like all of the other games have you know, this sort of animations effect, you can see how the chest opens, how it unrolls, like, I don't know how to say that, but it, it just looks cool in other games. In novel action, you just you click one button and poof, you just see your stuff in the warehouse. It's not so exciting, not so emotional, there is no this sort of building atmosphere of doing so. But nonetheless, I hope it's going to be at least cool. Maybe not also, maybe not great, but at least cool. So let's first start with them opening mission chests, because they usually give less stuff than the silver chests. I don't have much hold in my India man. You would ask me why am I opening my chests inside the ship hold? Well, this is because I don't want them to get mixed up with the stuff I've got in the warehouse. I want to know what I've got from the chest. Okay, first mission chest. Are you sure that you want to open mission chest? Yeah, I just click the button. Either <clears throat> cancel of confirm and nothing exciting. You just get that stuff in my ship hold. There we go. It's basic swivel gun. Crap. I really do not like these crap mods that have been introduced into the ah, novel action. Second one, it's basic hooks. Another crap mod. God damn it. I'm not really lucky with this. For chest, for chest mission chest, it's copper plating. No, it's wood sheeting. Maybe it's not so terrible, but it's not really a good mod in my opinion. Okay, what is it? Was it optimized bus? Are you serious? With this sort of luck, we're just gonna end up with like 20 crop mods. Okay, next, next, next. Ooh, two items. Improved must ups. Not bad, I would say. I don't know much about this mod yet. Mask, musket accuracy 0 0.02, it's 2%, very little bonus, very, very little. Petero guns 6%, it's not the worst, but I wouldn't call it very useful. Okay, next mission chest, there we go. Oh, this is going to be another sort of improved flintlock, just 4%, crappy one. Okay, let's move on, next mission chest. Is it... Improved mass stops again. Okay, that's the second one. Okay, next one. Here we go. What is it going to be? It's uh, ooh, extra buckets. Now it's open magazine. Ah, uh, maybe it's good. I don't know. I I really wouldn't use that one, but it's not the worst. Okay, and it has a cool icon. Okay, next one is it light courages. Uh, we have light courages as a permanent as a knowledge. I don't like it. Oh, yes! Brown, best, the musket mod. Pretty much any new musket mod is OP. 
This is what we are after mostly, the musket mods. Ooh, it's the sea service toolbox. That's also a really good one. I'm happy I've got that. Bridge loading swivel gun. I think that's the best of the swivel mods. 7%, it's decent. Okay, next mission chest. I think that's the last one. It's a uh, wall gun, 5%, so so medicor. Okay, now let's start with the silver chest. We've got like seven of them. That's like almost all of the loot from one epic event. So that's a lot. Okay, let's start. Let's begin with the first one. We've got just one item. Apprentice Carpenters, 2%. What sort of crap is it that drops from a silver chest? Let's be serious. Okay, next one. It's uh, Saber and Almeria Gunpowder. Someone is killing me. Really? It is it is it for real? Okay, next chest, next chest. Wine rations. Okay, this is this is actually not so bad. Turning speed four percent, some morale boost. Maybe nothing crazy, but it's something new. Okay, next, next, next. Old flag officer. Finally, something good. And British ring referee. Average. Okay, we have. Three last chest. What is it going to be? What is it going to be? Okay, let's go on. This is going to be uh, Guacata gunpowder. Jesus. And extra wine again. And maybe extra grog. It's wine rations. Okay, I'll take that. Maybe it will come in handy at some point. The one before the last. Mm, improved mass tops again. Yeah, okay. And was it British gunners? Yes. <laughs> what British gunners? No one's using that model. I would at least never use it. Okay, the last one. The last one. Please, please, something good. Oh, that's lots of stuff. What is it? Improved sextant. Bingo. Wall guns. I don't care. Almeria gunpowder. I don't care. Agamemnon. No, that's okay. And the wind book. Now, how's that? It's one book just gave so much good stuff. And like the previous five books gave only crap. Some, you know, like one mod, one mod that's like worth thousand reels, maybe, maybe even less than thousand reels. It, it's like 500 reels worth nothing, literally. And suddenly one silver chest just suddenly gives five items, a note, a book. Really good upgrade, permanent, improved sextant, 4% speed. Oh god, I just hate RNG and these drops because of all of the new mods introduced into the naval action of the patch 27. The loot from V chests is most of the time just crappy. You have to be really lucky to get like bunch of good stuff. It should be more balanced in my opinion. That's, that's just my opinion. So anyway, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this sort of open without any fancy effects. Let me know in the comments what you think about that video. And see you in the next episode.